Hi guys, welcome back to another English lesson. My name is Kika Rodriguez and in today's video I'm going to explain the whole class in English. That's because I promised you. I promised you in the last video. I promised that if my last video reached more than a thousand of views in less than 24 hours, I was going to explain a whole class in English and that's what I'm doing right now. So in today's video, in today's lesson, we have a fable, a fable written by Aesop. Who was Aesop? Aesop was an ancient Greek uh, writer. I guess he lived in ancient Greece at about 2000 years ago. So Aesop was the first man in the world who wrote fables. So this is a fable uh, called The Fisher and the Little Fish because uh, it is a story about a little fish that was caught by a fisher. Let's get started with the reading. It happened that the fisher, after fishing all day, caught only a little fish. Pray, let me go, master said the fish. I am much too small for your eating just now. If you put me back into the river, I shall soon grow, then you can make a fine meal of me. Nay, nay, little fish, said the fisher. I have you now, I may not cut you hereafter. And the moral says, a little thing in hand is worth more than a great thing in prospect. So, the, uh, what we got here is a little thing. The little thing is here the fish, the little fish. Because it's in hand of the fisherman. So, the fisherman now, now has that little thing. But it is worth more than a great thing. Uh, the great thing is that it is in prospect. In prospect means that it is in future. He does have the little thing right now, but he doesn't have a great thing in future because in future uh, he doesn't know that he is going to have that uh, great thing in future. In future means in prospect. Okay, guys, so uh, see you then. If you like the video, please thumbs up and share the video. Put a comment right down and see you later. Bye-bye. Thanks for watching my videos. Bye.